so dynamite it's kinuki from dynamic reactions and we are here for westworld season four episode five Z Zon zengazi is that what that is? i hope i said that right if i didn't say that right y'all are free to correct me um hell we found out has taken over the world per se as we know it um everyone's in trouble a lot of you asked um why i think dolores is in the sublime um and do i think dolores is in on it and i plan on answering those questions in the reaction not here because i don't want this intro to be too long so when we get to a dolores scene i could stop explain everything and as little time as possible but yes i'm really excited to get into this episode so without further ado let's get into this reaction special shout out to my subscribers and subscribers in the last three days your name will appear on the sticker i love y'all thank you for the support all right let's do this thing you should have seen the look on his face he couldn't believe it I don't want to be near this man. Not as my witness. <laughs> but I'm the I'm probably not going to do any permanent damage. We represent Oh very my god. Investment. Is he in the park? Effort. Or is he like in the when city? Cuz they did show the city in the beginning. Like the flesh closing around. I wanted them to be quiet. They're quiet now. <laughs> William There are no rules here. She's about to die, isn't That's she? The point. Back to where she came from. <laughs> I'm so curious. What does that mean? Those are obviously real people, because we're in the real world. William broke their programming. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna talk while the theme song is happening here. So, from what I'm understanding so far, humans are being controlled, we know this. Um, kind of like hosts per se that woman that William just went to I'm not sure if she was a host or a human but I'm leaning towards host just because of the way that she treated those people and the fact that William told Clementine you know take her back to wherever she came from which I would assume is the sublime but that's just me. And it's just a theory. Oh. Mm -hmm. my God. No, Someone had a good like date with Teddy. Fake and in the real world. Mm. The kinds of things that feel most real are just stories. Mm. Okay. Nothing to something Teddy says last night. Okay, okay, okay. I'm pausing here. I'm pausing here. I was waiting for a good segue. So, um, some of y'all asked why I think Dolores is in the sublime. One of you said that her friend having the dream with the fly should have told me that she wasn't in the sublime. I kind of disagree with that. And here's why. We know from our time that we spent with Bernard that the sublime can give you glimpses of the future, of what's happening in the outside world. And we also know that it lets the host choose the path that makes them the most happy or the path that they want to stay in. This path that Dolores is on, which Teddy brought up in his um lines with her in his conversation with her last episode this path that Dolores 
is on. It has Teddy in it. It has like all the proper things that he used to do. She's going out on dates. She's telling stories. She's living a relatively happy life. However, I also feel like the sublime would also be able to tell her if something is going on in the world that isn't too necessarily her liking or how she would have left things. So her painting the machine that controls humans' minds, that's one subtle way. Her friend having to dream about the flies. These kinds of lines of dialogue where she's like, sometimes the most wonderful things are just stories. Like, I feel like all of these things are just little hints to let us know that she isn't fully conscious in this real world. This isn't the real world. This is either the sublime or something of her subconscious self. That's my theory. <laughs> Look at the subtle accent slip. That's really good. I told you. Say it. She can't say it. Ooh. And see, here's the other thing about Dolores being in the real world. Wouldn't she hear that machine? Not bad. But I've seen better. Ma'am! There. She Ma seems bored. Experiencing God. The problem is, God is bored. Yep. She's bored. I figured that. Dang, Tessa Thompson! I made off your code. We all so are. he is a host. Yep. And you should know that I don't like coming to this shithole any more than I have to. You've never liked this place. It was supposed to be a stopgap. A drug that our kind was hooked on that we could give up like a child casting away their toys. A place to indulge ourselves with the humans. Mm-hmm. My theory was right. Can't get enough. This is wild up close. Yeah. The humans are infecting us. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. I was right. Was set to come here to transcend. Transcend where, if not the sublime. They seem as wedded to their one thing. Oh, that's the flower that she was holding. Like to know I have at least. They have a conscience. That's what's happening. Maybe there's a flaw in your programming. Maybe you need to look at yourself, girlfriend. There's no flaw in my program. Then why the fuck can't you solve my outlier problem? There's something wrong with her, too. Look at that. You're bleeding. Damn it. Oh. What you made me do. We've been self-harming. Maybe it's better if I just showed you. Please show us, Teddy. I want to know where exactly we are. So, we are in the real world, and we have the same power as Hale, who is another version of ourself. Interesting. He found her first. Man. machine they can't you see it so alone. interesting mm. oh I see it too she's nice mm. 
William, you said you weren't going to be having conversations. Now look at you. Oh, thank God. Oh, I didn't want her to die. Come on, you won't be out long. Y'all better move away fast in that boat. Okay, they're gone. Christina. Oh. So great to see you. Of course. Oh, please, I'm screaming. Was right on time. <laughs> I don't want to jinx it. <laughs> I have my ways of making people talk. Mmm. It's so weird because it's a different version of herself. I'm screaming. She was keeping tabs. And she probably thinks she's being nice by giving that version of herself the life she thinks she deserves. I hope you didn't mess that up, girlfriend. She's gonna start that narrative. No search. Dolores? Dolores? There we go. Dolores. Amarna. Restricted access? Uh-huh, she's trying to keep her down. What are you doing? What? He's made to keep tabs on her. Have you ever questioned the nature of your reality? Ah, not these questions again! No. Straight to the brain. Stop! Um... Yeah, girl, get out. Annette told her the truth. Mm-hmm. She's out to see him. Mm-hmm. He means the needle. What is this? A secret room? That is the game. Man. This sucks for this version of Dolores, bro. Oh, wait, he's releasing real William. You have a question? Oh, God. Real William is about to mess host oh, yeah, William up. This is why she didn't want him talking to the other why do you want to know? outlier. I interacted with one, an outlier. Maybe not not the eyebrow the race. Nature of your own reality. Right. I agree with this, William, for once. There it is. Mm-hmm. You sort of, yeah. What an episode. Oh my god. What if Hale set all this up so that Dolores could wake up and give her something less boring to do? That wouldn't surprise me. That's terrifying. Okay. Um, what an amazing episode. This season is really good. I'm really enjoying it. So now we know that Dolores is in the real world. I was wrong. Um, it makes sense that Hale would put that version of herself there to give Dolores some type of you know, dream life that she figured she would deserve while also trying not to wake that part of herself up. Because I think Hale knows that if that part of herself is awakened, uh, there will be trouble. But again, I'm thinking that maybe she was testing Dolores earlier in the episode to see 
if she was getting woken up because we do see that she is getting bored. That wouldn't shock me. She seems to have a bit of an ego. Um, I can't wait to see what the other outliers do, what other story lies there. I'm very interested in them and their mission and what Bernard is doing with me. So yeah, I can't wait for next week. Thank y'all for watching this episode of Westworld with me. If you're new here, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We react to Westworld every single Monday. So be sure to turn on notifications for that. And yeah, I will see you guys on the next one. I love you. You're important. Peace out.